Hi there, I am Ye Hao Yang. I'm also known as Zoe. Nice to meet you. 很高兴认识你 I matriculated in 2014 to do my PhD in astrophysics at the Cavendish Laboratory. Now I'm working as a postdoctoral researcher in Leiden University, the Netherlands. I love Mary Edwards College, and I really miss it. It creates such an equal, friendly, and supportive environment that everyone is so ready to give you a hand if you need. I have received enormous help and support from college and the wonderful graduate community in terms of how to deal with sexual harassment, how to take care of my mental health. Studying at Mary Edwards, I have always been encouraged to explore, to challenge, and to thrive. Everyone around you is very open-minded and deeply empathetic. Women support women is never just a slogan there. I also miss my supportive college tutors, the wonderful food in the dorm, the lovely porters, and other friendly staff. In the Gateway program, I really enjoyed the career-related sessions. I remember the career advisor Sheila. She gave me good advice on how to write my CV. I participated in the work shadowing program. I really appreciate the opportunity to shadow a working professional for a day, providing me many insights into the industry. Attending Gateway program is also a great way to make friends, especially when you are new at the college. The atmosphere is always supportive. So I felt very safe to share my worries and problems. After finishing my PhD, I went back to China. For my first job, I worked as a postdoctoral researcher at a Chinese university. For a typical day at work, I read academic papers, work on my research projects, attend research talks that I find interesting. Writing papers, communicating with collaborators, and writing funding proposals is also a part of the job. I also work as a freelancer book translator. I have already translated six books from English to Mandarin. From a PhD student to a postdoc researcher, the transition is not as huge as in some other industries. I'm grateful that I have met many kind seniors and peers. They guided me, helped me, and supported me. But I also have met people who intentionally make me feel less than I actually am for different reasons, or sometimes no reason at all. I respect them, but I'm not going to be one of them. I hope you would never be treated like that. But if you are, don't take it too personally, because sometimes you are simply not standing on the same ground. Smile and carry on. I have three career suggestions for current students. One, explore early. If you have already made up your mind about which career path you will be following, that's great. Go find the resources you need, make connections, learn and demonstrate essential skill sets, apply for internships, or even start your own business. For those who still don't know what you really want in life, that is great too. Be adventurous. Be courageous. Reach out. And explore the fields that interest you most. This wouldn't guarantee you finding a lifelong passion, but you will gain lots of great experience, and you will understand yourself better along the way. Two, the second suggestion is very short: be kind. Be kind to yourself, and this helps you to be kind to others. Three, my last suggestion is: surround yourself by people you like and you respect. If they are not around you yet, go find them and introduce them into your life. Thank you very much, and Zoe. I wish you all the best. 祝你一切顺利。